We're gonna go into the Treasures of Xandar. We haven't been in there yet. Uh, when we came for the uh, opening weekend, there was a line right here, all the way up this walkway to get into the, the Treasures of Xandar. But today there's no line, we can just walk right in. So let's take a look and see what they got. This is a mini, mini, mini backpack. That thing's teeny tiny. It looks like they have the same pins as they had last time. These are silver, so $9.99, a couple of keychains. Oh, look, it opens. Oh, look, it's a metal badge. Oh, I see, it's magnetic. Only $10, wow. Well, it actually sticks to the one behind it. Wow, there's a classic game. For $15, yikes. Classic 80s style, let's get physical shirt. <laughs> Here's that classic style coffee mug, uh, $20. And here's more of the pins. These are the same pins that were here on opening day. This one's yellow, I think that's $12.99. And they have these Peter Quill masks. So that's $50. I wouldn't put that on my face. And it will look like that on your head. They have the whole interactive uh, Infinity Gauntlet. Well, it's not the Infinity Gauntlet. It's actually Iron Man's book. So these are $100. And you can also buy the individual Infinity Stones, which will actually go into the gauntlet, which is these right here. So each one of the Infinity Stones is $100 on top of the $100 Iron Man gauntlet. And if you don't want to spend the money on the $100 Infinity Gauntlet, you can also get this $40 Infinity Stone case. I just finished up in the Treasures of Xandar. Um, it's a small little gift shop, specifically for that ride. Think the Figment gift shop, it's about that big. Um, there's nothing in there that wasn't here on opening day, so if you saw all of that stuff, that's what's in there. There's just less pins, so. Have you been on Guardians of the Galaxy? Have you been in Treasures of Xandar and seen what they have available? Put it in the comments below, but until then, remember, no capes.